Jimmy D reporting for Speed Scene Live. We're at the Show and Go 2008. This is Kenny Ash. He's a Grand Marshal of this event. Tell us a little bit about Show and Go and how it got started. Well, you know, it started 10 years ago, and it started out as a car show and a drag race where they, you know, Saturday they did a car show and Sunday it was a drag race at either the airport or, you know, a sanctioned drag strip or whatever. And, uh, you know, I've done both ends of it. The car I have, though, is, is primarily the show car part of it. The original inception was to mock a funny car, and you know, even though these are all car people, a lot of them have not been to a funny car race, mm -hmm. at nighttime especially. And uh, funny cars at night, they have, you know, the nitro flames coming out of the zoomies and stuff, and it's just, just an awesome appearance, you know, after dark. And that's what I was trying to mock, was that. And it actually worked out better than I ever thought it could have. Yeah. Yeah, it runs really well. You see this car coming down the street. The people just come to the street and watch and wait for this car to come out and pass them and, and hoop and holler. And they want more flame, more noise, and they just go wild about it. What's the turnout for this weekend compared to years past? Oh, you know what? They limit it at 1,000 cars just because of the size of the cruise route and stuff, the, you know, the parameters of downtown, what the city would allow. So, and actually they maxed out, you know, a couple days before the event. A lot of car shows, you can actually enter the day of the car show. Yeah. And this one actually sold out a couple days before. And that just is a, a, a true indication of how popular it is. You, know? you mentioned any sponsors that you might have in this car? Well, for me, for sure, yeah. Without this, you know, and this car is a money pit, man. I was dumping money in it. You know, it goes through motors, it goes through trans, rear ends, everything, everything. It goes through everything. but. You know, I, I hooked up with Wayne's Engines here in Riverside, and they have just, they're helped me out greatly. You know, so I have, you know, actually it's just mostly routine maintenance now. And routine me maintenance means you have to tear the motor down, put bearings, and maybe a crank and that stuff. But, yeah. I, you know, I've been running on the same block for like five years, so oh, that's you good. Know, a lot better, yeah. Yep. Does the, does the methanol, does it affect the engine at all? I mean, gasoline, methanol, nitro, they all have power increases, but the uh, alcohol is clean, burning, it, it doesn't put any wear on the engine? Oh, yeah, alcohol is actually a solvent. It's not a, it's, it's you know, it, they use it as a solvent. So it, it's squeaky clean. So there's problems with that. Anybody that runs uh, methanol or even straight ethanol, and that's why they don't do more ethanol in the street, too. They have flex fuel cars right now. But methanol is even worse. If you're going to run 100% alcohol, there, you know, you have to run a upper cylinder wall lubricant. Oh. And then if you're doing what I do right now, I can, I can run the car like, you know, just normal jetting. But I also can enrich in it to where it's actually just kind of like flooding the motor. But alcohol is not sensitive to richness. Oh. All it does is start flaming. Okay. And that's what you know. And that was the accident part of this car. You know. It, it, I, I didn't know it was going to do it, you know, when I put it together. Uh, besides Wayne's, do you have any other sponsors you'd like to hit? Uh, Bud's Tires and Wheels have been a great help. You know, we up, you know, on a lot of the bigger car shows and stuff like that, we have like a little camp encampment. Mm -hmm. And Bud's Tires and Wheels, they, they help me out hugely with a lot of stuff. We normally have bands and all that kind of stuff going on, and they pay for that. Wayne's is doing like a, a barbecue, you know, they pay for everything. and. And all the revenues go to, you know, charity. You know, it's a good deal. Yeah. And we're having fun.